I praise and honor glory to you. How Bashim, Yahweh Shah, Bashim, Rakhagadash. That belongs to Apostle Elder's great millstone peace citations to society and pushing the words to serve the truth and charity. Uh, brothers from the branch of Great Millstone, Chicago, Lord Williams edifying to the hopeful righteous elect. And this is a quick and transit, you know, pretty much on how Esau intentionally destroys Jake's neighborhoods. To, uh, pretty much dirty Jake's name. Have the world think that Jake don't take care of their shit. Jake is destructive. You know, but really, Esau set set this up, man. The way it is, man. All right. Yeah, you about to say so. Yeah, there's a uh, so there's a lot of uh, small things that Esau does. All right. That's you know pre-planned, but it, it it destroys you know Jake's communities. All right. And um, you know there's several different things, right? You'll have, uh, for instance, you know how you. We'll have um, streets and sanitations, right? Come throughout, you know, neighborhoods to, you know, clean up the area. If you notice, their main focus would be in whatever downtown area, you know, whatever city you live in. They'll focus on that pocket or the rich, you know, areas where, of course, Esau lives, right? And out here, we have neighborhoods, uh, um, you know, Old Town, Lincoln Park, yeah. you know, Beverly. These are where, you know, these Edomites live and they're always attended to, okay? You know, they, they always have people, you know, cleaning up the, uh, the the streets. When I say streets, I'm talking about the actual roads where you drive on and also the sidewalks. You have little things like this, uh, as Dollar and I uh, were talking about, they'll have garbage cans set up throughout their neighborhoods so people are constantly you know throwing their trash out without having to you know hold on to it you know see in jake areas they don't do that okay they barely come by they'll, they'll pick up your garbage right but they won't necessarily you know um you know have people clean up if there's you know just random trash you know in the streets you know or like how i mentioned the garbage cans you know on the corners and stuff they won't put that there yeah you know, uh, even uh, like I said, the garbage. I think in Esau's areas, they'll, I think I believe they'll come more than once a week. Yeah, more than likely, I I, I believe that. Yep. Yeah, but uh, Jake's, I, I know, I, you know, like I try sometimes. The garbage, they'll they'll come once a week. You know, it's one fucking trash can with six apartments. Oh yeah, they'll do that too. Yep. Yeah. That, yep. That's that's key that you mentioned that. Yeah. How they'll uh, purposely not give up, uh, even though they know that there's several units in this particular building, they'll uh, pur purposely in Jake's neighborhood, they'll give like maybe two trash cans. So then you have your trash all over, you know, eventually people are going to have to put it on the side, you know, yeah. and yeah. start stacking up. And then what, what does that create? An infestation of uh, 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 rodents. That's it. So now your neighborhood, they're not only just rodents, but, um, uh, you know, cockroaches, things under that nature. Yeah. Now you look dirty. Yeah. yeah. And uh, unclean and unsanitary. Yeah. You know? And then sometimes they might not even come. This happened. It'd be two weeks. Like, then when the garbage man will come, mm -hmm. they'll wait. It'd be two whole weeks that they'll miss coming out to, to, to get this trash. You know, so all this trash just stacked up, man. Yep. And all over the damn place. Uh, another thing. Oh boy, bro. I was gonna say another thing that Esau does to make your neighborhood look bad is uh, I seen actually a video on this. You'll have these Edomites with money, right? Investors. Because you gotta remember before they start um, gentrifying an area, before they, you know, uh, start, you know, uh, building up particular neighborhoods, they have to go to the city, right? in order to, you know, get plans going. They, get, they gotta get everything verified. So what a lot of these, um, you know, Edomite investors do is they'll go throughout your neighborhood, buy up property and let it sit, all right? They let it sit, board it up, 
you know, make it look real trashy for about a decade. So then the property value, you know, it, 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 it crumbles, right? It goes down. And when they start, you know, building up, you know, the area up, now they're, they're making all this profit on it, you know? Yeah. You see? They do all these things to, uh, you know, to destroy Jake and, and to, you know, and to get gain in this world. That's it. And not to mention, I probably would be a lesson. They don't power wash the buildings in J.K. Yeah. Blue, so the building is all dingy. Yep. Uh, for a year. And then, we, yeah, we did less on. Now, what did that do? That, that affects Jake's look, you know, that affects Jake's mood, their health. Yep. Barely have any uh, landscapes. You know. Especially out here in uh, Chicago. They tend to, now it's, I'll say this, it's effective in um where we live at right you know uh -huh. to have like more dark colors because especially during the winter time you you want the sunlight to be absorbed but point being though is you know they 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 purposely make it real gloom and doom in jake areas like the elder said they don't they don't even try to like you know throw you know some some, some colors to, to accent the building you know what i'm saying right. they don't have any flowers out right bugged out man so lock you. <laughs> We're in downtown now. You know how people are. Right. But uh, you know they do all these things to the, uh to destroy Jake's mind. But um, I want to get this scripture out if I may. Oh yeah, go ahead, brother. Um, but at the end of the day, before I get the scripture, I want to say this real quick. Jake is way better than Esau. All right, I gotta mention that Jake is way better than Esau, because like I was telling the elder, you know, you give Jake, um, one of course guidance. And then two, a little bit of you know money to up, you know to, to basically upkeep this area. He's gonna be on a, a on a higher level than Esau. Esau's Esau's base. We're the ones who are actually really, uh, in a sense, running this society. Because if we weren't involved, this society would crumble immediately. That's it, bro. You know, not to mention Esau put on front. I've seen it with my own two eyes. Esau put he'll keep his outside nice. Maybe doing the garden outside, keep it nice. Or you go inside, it's crap, it's filthy every goddamn where they're a bunch of goddamn hoarders. Mm -hmm. You know, it'd be shit all over the goddamn place. I seen him, man. So you can't tell me that I'm not that I'm lying, man. I seen him with my own two eyes. Yep. And not to mention uh brother Yaj Riley, he got a nice little spot. He told tell me he's a devil next door to him. That nigga filthy. Yeah, house next door to the brothers. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he told me he like man, this devil is filthy as fuck, man. Yeah, and you got to remember too, these Edomites, they hire landscapers, yeah. maids, okay, all sorts of um, service people, right? Service workers, whatever you want to call it, you know, to come out to 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 basically maintain what they have, mm -hmm. you know, giving a manicure, so to speak. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, I was right. He told me when he was in um. Lived in Beverly, you know. You might see how he took care of his property shit. They took notes from him. Exactly. I, <laughs> exactly. But, um, on, I'm going to get this uh, precept. This is Proverbs 12 and 26. The righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the way of the wicked seduces them. Oh, that's a good one. So we're, you know, we're, we're, we're at a higher level than Esau. But see, what, what has happened throughout the generations is, you know, this man has castrated us economically, all right? He has uh, uh, destroyed, you know, our households by giving, you know, the, the woman, you know, uh, uh, power, you know, leadership, all right? You know, music, ha ha you know, has, has really did a number on our, our, our people. I don't know why I thought that was fucking morale. <laughs> but, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, because uh, uh, we've talked about it. About yeah. how, in particular, you know, rap, all right, in specific, gangster rap, had has really done a number on our people. Mm -hmm. All right, our people are uh, are ready to uh, murder one another. All right, um, steal, commit adultery, sell drugs, use drugs, and now we're at a point where it's gotten so bugged out where even look, put it like this. 
the women are more gangster than the men now. All right, and, and, and the men are sissy boys. Oh yeah. Homo thug rap. Okay. That's, that's it. Yeah, I got uh, family members. They tell me, not not saying that Jake was as righteous even then. Jake has always been, you know. But they say like, man, when this gangster rap, I, family members, gangster rap came out. It's like Jake got w even worse yep. than what they were before. Mm -hmm. You know, you see, so that, that was the part of the witchcraft he saw used to destroy our people, man. Uh, you got um, Second Corinthians two and eleven because we're not ignoring your, your your damn devices, man. You see, now you're getting exposed on on these things, man. And the Lord's going, how about Shimei is going to make you pay for all this shit, man? You're doing, man, all this wickedness, man. And um, not to mention, you mentioned um, street cleaning. Oh no, don't forget the potholes. Oh, all, there's all types of potholes in Jake's neighborhood that Esau's never going to attend to. But when you go out to, I'd say, hey, or, or Lagrange Road, yeah. Orleans Square, with them Edomites, Esau was always fixing up these streets, man. Mm -hmm. We would go out there every week, and they'll be fixing. Like, damn, how much more fix? This, this street's smoother than a baby's ass. How much more fixing you need to do, man? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you yep. know? But that, that's what this devil does. But you got other fucking streets that need to be attended to, and this devil never around to fix it, man. In yep. Jake's neighborhoods, man. Uh, yeah, go ahead, bro. I got another one. Psalms 119, I'll start at 84. How many are the days of thy servant? Oh, yeah, I might say this. I mean, we need to get the hell out of here. Ooh, show you Jake got slave mentality. Why would you want to rely on this devil for anything, man? You know, y'all, you, you, you niggas complain, but yet you got to come to this dude for wrong all things, man. Mm -hmm. That's stupid as hell, man. Why, why do you need to come to him? <laughs> to have some type of business in your neighborhood and stuff. Oh, it's good that they put in some. Uh, why don't you have your own shit, man? You see? But we understand it's part of curses, but the thing is, Jake just... Jake is a child. That's what yeah, it comes down that's to. that's it, bro. Jake has, has been beaten so... He's been being down so much that they're, they're like little children now. If they don't have their daddy telling them what to do, and to give them, a, you know, a, a pat, you know, on the back and all that, you know, they they, they, they don't know what to do. They lose their minds. Yeah, I can understand. I don't know what the world would be without you saw you. Guess what? It's going to be more peaceful. How about that? Exactly. Go ahead, brother. This is uh, Psalms 119 and 84. How many are the days of thy servant? When will thou execute judgment on them that persecute me? The proud have digged pits for me, which are not after thy law. You see, that's what um, Esau has done. Okay. He has dig pits for us, and they're they're, they're not the ways of Yahweh Shimei Al Shai. They're not the, uh, a righteous way, okay? They're, they're 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 not to uplift you. Yeah. These things are to make you fall, okay, and to bury you, so to speak. You know, mm -hmm. this guy doesn't want to uh, assist you and aid you. He's your enemy, man. Exactly. Look at all these. Like, I, for some reason, this comes to mind. You know, we're just getting fresh water. You look at Flint, Michigan. Out here, there's a, um, a small south suburb called Dixmore, and that's basically all Jake, you know, probably like 100 percent, you know, Southern Kingdom. Yeah. Right. They've been having all these piping issues for the past like two years, mm -hmm. you know, for like two years straight. How come and, and we're talking about they even called a, a, a declared a state of emergency in, in, in that uh, in that suburb. Mm -hmm. why, why is there still problems? It's because the guy doesn't like you. Yeah. All right. Simple as that. He doesn't like you, you know, but he has it, a perpetual hatred. Yeah. You. you know, but, you know, it, you know, you, but you still got like how the other said, but you still got Jake, you know, up this dude's ass, you know? Yeah, man. Just homeborn slaves, man. Huh. But a beautiful thing is, you know, Lord, at some point, the Lord is going to get us out of this fucking place. It don't matter what you two thirds think. That's the beautiful thing about it, man. You leave it up to him. You, you kiss everybody. Kiss they they life goodbye. It was up to the two thirds because they won't stay here. In this fucked up ass society, man. God. But oh, hey, boy. yeah, <laughs> you know they don't. Yeah, yeah. Like man, we understand. Hey, we understand. That's another lesson. We understand. You know, now that the Lord's way is better. Yeah. We went through these other ways. Outside of the way the Lord said it's supposed to be, 
And we see the results of that, man. Uh, it's horrible. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> you know? I got a little more. Uh, okay, go, go ahead, bro. This is uh, Psalms 119 and 86 now. All thy commandments are faithful. They persecute me wrongfully. Help thou me. And that's what Esau does. He, he persecutes us wrongfully. They can mind their own business. And somehow this guy will, will, will destroy your entire, you know, situation. And, you know, we've seen that, you know, mm -hmm. uh, in the past, you know, with history. You know, Jake, you know, they, they, they'll, um, you know, have a, a small communities that are thriving. And this guy will literally bomb y your your whole city. Yeah. Literally uh, 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 murder an entire, you know, community just because you're 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 doing good mm -hmm. that's wild as hell man yeah, but the, mob, it, the mob games they'll come in right yeah you know and you know, you know i know um yeah, the elder malcolm the elder south side mike out here they, they've gone into it many of times you've had um in specific out here there's a community called bronzeville kenwood mm -hmm. you know the basically the uh, the uh the bronzeville was it called the black belt yeah and uh the edomites were getting mad because jake had better, you know, uh, architecture. Okay. You know, they, 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 they were, you know, more in tune with the arts. All right. They had their own businesses mm -hmm. and they were, you know, mad about that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you know, the trick that Jake fell for, he saw like, okay, yeah, man, you know, you can shop in our neighborhoods now. What do they do? So you're not putting money into your own community. So they had to shut down. And now Ishmael can come on in, and Elam and shit. Yeah, you know that was all a trap by so All right. Would like to say only reason this stuff works is because we under the curses, man. You mm -hmm. know, yeah, how about Shimi Al Shah allowed it to happen, man? Because of these curses, man. Because prior to that, Jake did had their own businesses in their neighborhood. They called them mom pop shops and all that. You know. He my brother. He he remember that when he was little. You know, he he used to he tell me about it. You see, yeah, man. So yeah, again, we're not giving you advice. We see what you're doing. You know, you're not slick. You're not hiding from the Lord. Cause that's well, he's calling him out anyway, man. He thinks he he's doing these things in secret and nobody's seeing his punk ass. You know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You know, That's, we're at the end of days. At the uh, end of days, the scriptures talk about what you know. Esau is going to be ma made bare. Yep, and the but, Lord always saw your ass. Oh yeah, yep. First and foremost. Mm -hmm. But you know, now the Lord has opened up our eyes, and and now even this whole system is you know exposing you because you're look, you're you're being exposed as the, as the, the man of sin, the son of perdition. All right, and that's that. Mm -hmm. And while I look for a thumbnail for this video, I came across the article that said how the government destroyed, created the ghetto ghettos. Yep. See, so that's right on point. Yeah. Uh, this topic. I mean, even the name project, it's a damn science experiment. Oh, yeah, the projects. And you notice they build them in the X shape. All, mm. all the projects, if you notice, the design and stuff is you be over. Uh, you know the uh, with the, the roof part, like you fly yeah. a helicopter. It's like it's Bird, like, like an X. You. Yeah, bird's eye view the water. It's like an X shape, like yeah. a target. Yep. You see. So man, this devil would never like you that you so called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. And I was telling brother, simple fact is, if one of y'all move in their neighborhood, and they, and they would say, um, and they move out. <laughs> All to move out and more of your people move in. That, that shows you right there they don't like your ass. Nope. All right. You see? Look, you ain't there. Yeah, yeah. So, um, yeah, so we, um, Lord wants to find the hope for righteous elect, you know. We, um, at destination right now. Yeah, but so, like I said, that's long as 2 and 8 said, man, you know, it's a process the Lord's doing. Now he's having you damn devils disposed through the mouth of the prophets you know and he's making Esau telling himself man he's having this devil ex expose himself man yep. too you see and then Yahushua, you know, that's happened. all this happening now and then Yahushua will come 
and physically take you devils down, man. Pursuing the Second Thessalonians two and eight, it said destroying them with the brightness of his coming. All right. So with that, I give all praise down the glory to you. How Bashim Yahweh Shah Bashim Kabbalah. The blind possibilities, great millstone, peace, citations to society and pushing his words, sincere truth and charity. Shalom. Shalom.